This is the kitchen gym for the real of those series, and this is the PC version of the game. Um, I have to tell you about this. The graphics quality has very much um, hurt my PC. That's why I'm not going to do this. And I need to check something because the page where I took from it the game told me to check it out even Horizon and um, Trojan Horse, Trojan uh, Quest. I think the controls is for everything. I don't need to do anything. I just hear and the music for this because for some reason the current uh, owner told me that sometimes the uh, master clip will uh, be cancelled for some reason. It's like a glitch. Where exactly Event Horizon? Event Horizon. I'm using right now Fraps. My PC is Alienware MX14. It's a very standard uh, Alienware. Very good. Still, because of the poor computers that I have, I cannot raise the graphics at all. The first two times you raise the graphics, and uh, things will begin to change. I'll try you just slightly to show you what the graphics are. Don't worry, I will change the graphics back to normal once they see what just the changes are instantly. Again, this is the new type of the graphics. Sadly, my laptop cannot take it. I can see over here. This is, these are the adults, the teenagers, and the kids. You can choose whoever you want of them. And there's a very nice game that you all know and love, Christina. Let's see that in the next one. The way she walks to the sun, the way she looks like in the sun, no one can do it. Here's that I've I can't tell the pictures I just got on the screen. Yeah. Uh, this time I will change. Clothing will change. You can see that the are a little bit more humanoid than the normal game. I would come with this one. The problem is that I said you cannot. I wanna go and play. It's been good for me. Good for me. Good for me. It's not that I'm going to. Now that we have some fun in the game, we're going to play for fun. But I'm not going to be scared of the guns. That's why I have all these tools. Go back to options and fix the graphics to the lowest. Even if I took the second, uh, the first uh, strongest of the graphics, my computer cannot help the look. I'm so sorry. But I tried it and it failed. Anyway, I'll just begin right now with the new game. Back to our very ordinary matches um, I think. The adults, the teens, the kids. Again, let's meet with the kids once more. 
as you saw again, and her beautiful walking animation is much smoother and less catchy than the Batman. Because of the best graphic shield, I don't think it's more than uh, a little bit. Let's go with the great editor. Let's go with the big uh, Albino. Albino. Uh, let's see from this week. Let's keep showing you. So I want to go and play. Great, I already showed you the book for default color. Don't leave it up and die. Don't turn this one. Blue and white. Are nice. Blue and the black, this is beautiful, this suits her hair and the top suits her headband. Beautiful. I will take this one. Just quickly check out the other one. Nah, I'll take the black one. Her name is already great as is. Nice to meet you again. L P. This year we'll be unveiling our all new whoa coasters. These outrageous new coasters can only be found at Thrillville. Using my patented mortifier technology, they'll uh, uh, push the limits of fun and excitement. <laughs> Oh, hey, kid, I'm glad you're here. Thrillville is getting bigger than ever, and you're just the person to run the show. As park manager, you'll have to build lots of coasters and attractions and ride rides and talk to people and play games and have an absolutely incalculable amount of fun. We made a great team foiling the evil corporation Globo Joy last year. And I know we can outsmart them again. Just keep your eyes open for anything suspicious. Excuse me. Well, I've got more war coasters to prevent. You get started at Thrillville Stunts, and we'll talk when you get there. I promise to not use so much rocket fuel next time. Rocket fuel? <laughs> what? Welcome to Thrillville Stunts, your new home for thrills, chills, and also spills. This place already has a lot of rides, games, and coasters built in. So go have fun and make it your own. But watch out for those nasty critics. For some reason, they've been giving this park bad reviews. While you're getting to know your way around, try to find out what they're up to. Everything you do in the park creates thrills. And if you want, I'll send you out on missions that will help you make more. But now, let me show you what it takes to be a great theme park owner. Make your way over to one of those pillars of light, and we'll begin. Before we begin anything at all, I need to address something in here, in CPTV. First of all, this walkthrough was uh, requested by you, and that's why it's absolutely yours technically and truly that's why I will tell you right now I never played this game before at all I have no idea how to play it and I will just tell you about the things that I uh, recently just learned about it options you already know what they are tutorials they will teach you some stuff save game normally and go to HQ the headquarters is the place where we just left from before we begin anything at all, I will just have to go to the HQ. We will come back here, I swear. But for now, because I for totally forgot to check my hand watch for the timer. Let's
My laptop is already getting harder. Uh, here we can see the blue Okay, that's it. Uh, I'm so sorry, but the frame rate is dropping madly. Right now it's barely 20, for some reason. I'll finish this video the moment we reach the park, because I want to check out what's wrong with the laptop for the meantime. Um, as well, we will need to make sure Seriously, 11, 3, 4 frames per second? What the hell? Anyway, I will have to, uh, for the meantime, to stop the video. See you in the next one, once I set on a timer, to see how far I can go. So, I'll be right back. Okay, welcome back ZPTV to Thrillville of the Rails. Um, while I was uh, checking the... Um, Options menu. I found out where the Event Horizon game was uh, at. By the way, I uh, lowered down the volume, the music, and the speech because I found that they all were too high for you to hear what I say. Basically, it's inside here. Okay, to uh, the show them. Event Horizon. I added this uh, the F key here because the mouse button will freeze according to the torrent owner the moment I begin using the WSAD keys. That's why I chose to point the F since control itself is a hot key. Um, anyway, let's just get back to the game and begin it. Let's go to the tutorials. Okay, how do I move the camera? Okay, right click. Okay, Marshall doesn't have anything at all. I have right now 3000 and uh, 432. Money is. Uh, I'm getting more money. Let's go to build. Now that you're in charge, one of your most important jobs is to build rides and stalls in the park that will make your guests happy <laughs> and make you the most money. These build zones are for carnival rides, games, and stalls. Anytime you want to build something, simply walk into one of these zones and click the enter key or left mouse button. And my laptop is already overheating. What the hell? Two, three, four, five, four, five frames per second. Every attraction requires power in order to run. This meter shows you how much power each section of your park has left. Pay attention to it. I'm surprised that the game can still go on with only having four, three, or two frames per second. Let's start the first build mission. Tank Frenzy. Explain the masses and keep Thrillville cutting edge at the same time by dropping it down the new tra Tank Frenzy arcade machine. Tank Frenzy, this is the one? Yep, this is the one. So what do you have here? Shoot zone while the frontier. It's a sideshow bucking bull um, sideshow test your strength a squadron ace stunt ride tank frenzy 
while it was trampoline. Um, I will look at those things later for now. Let's just go to the tank frenzy. So how do we... okay. We use this one over here and according to it we will have to drag this game somewhere like this. Okay, please. Now let's talk about roller coasters. Okay. To build one, select coaster from the build menu or walk up to any coaster stand and take it from there. I'll okay. be there to help. Oh, and you'll just love some of the crazy new wall coaster pieces I'm designing. <laughs> These coasters do things that people never thought possible. <laughs> Amazing, huh? After you've placed down attractions, don't forget to paint and style them to look just the way you want them to. Okay. Now then, make your way over to another column of light. I'll catch up with you there. Okay. Next up, Mensch. Your park is in good shape when two things are healthy. Guest happiness and profit. Okay. You can use your cash to build new rides, hire staff, and run promotions. When you charge the right prices, your park value will soar. Okay. The park menu helps you manage the big picture by giving you lots of useful information about your park. Okay. The overview screen shows a summary of the guests in your park. It can help you see what your guests want. And the happier they are, the more money you'll earn. Okay. Use the park upgrade screen to research new rides. Or start a marketing campaign to attract more guests. Or even take out a loan. Okay. In park information, you'll find all kinds of useful charts that can help you see how your park changes over time. Okay. And finally, in Thrillville stats, you can see your greatest triumphs from all your parks, all in one place. Nice. Let's start the first managed mission. Media Mogul. Time to think big. Let's create a great advertising campaign that would have people fucking go Thrillville. Don't forget to put the ads where everyone can see them. Run any marketing campaign. Um, let's see here. Number of readers, teen appeal. No. Uh, adult appeal, moderate, very high, very low, low, moderate, uh, very high, moderate, high, low, very low, very, very, very low, very high. It's the same chance as the first game. Um, even though it's very low still, it's better than nothing. Well done! Remember, the park menu helps you decide how you want to manage the place. It shows you what you've done, and what you can do! Okay. Time for next... Uh... Okay, now head over to any other remaining column of light. We'll talk more when you get there. Okay. Don't forget CPTV, this is the first time I ever play this game, so I must have no idea at all how to play it. The park guests are your bread and butter. As park manager, one of your jobs will be to get to know them. Okay. You can talk to any guest by approaching them and pressing the left mouse button. Then select the guest you want to talk to from the list shown. Okay. You may want to just chat or ask them for park feedback. This will help you find out what's good and bad about your park. That's what I used to do in Thrillville, the first game. You see, uh, ZPTV, 